What you're looking at is a Buderis G115WS3. It's the smallest 115 Buderis makes. And it's oil fired with a Riel burner. And here is our hydro level high limit and associated piping. So um, as changes evolve in the industry, we evolve with them. And one of them is installing these Viridian pumps. This heating system is a brand new heating system and it uses um, European style radiators for heat emitters with thermostatic non-electric radiator heads. So what that means is each radiator individually will open and close as needed. And when that, when the radiators do change, uh, when they open and close, their flow rate also changes. That's where this pump comes into play. This pump, when it's set properly, will adjust to those settings of those thermostatic heads opening and closing. Instead of being in a two position pump, either on or off, on or off this will self adjust to the differential pressure. So as radiators open, this will speed up. As they close, it will slow down. And if you notice, I, I have it isolated. And I also have the suction side on the expansion tank, which is not code, but uh, it prohibits pumping directly into the tank. So and uh, here's a draft regulator and a return piping. Here's a Khalifi combination backflow preventer and our purge setups. Now I um, didn't necessarily have to add purge setups, but they make a great low point drain um, because we're draining each radiator individually. And here we have a European style Buderis radiator and it gets piped with supply and return lines. In this application, we used pro, some ProPress fittings. This was an existing application, so we did not have the option of putting the pipes in an ideal location. We basically were retrofitting some old steam pipes. And to avoid um, major renovation with opening walls, we um, decided to keep the piping in the uh, lo same location as it was previously. So these radiators, when sized properly, really perform well. And uh, an optional head that you can add to this is a thermostatic um, radiator sensor. And this will self-adjust. Right now it's set at five, but you can turn this to lower it or increase it depending on your comfort level. And inside here is a piston that will open and close the valve to allow or to allow more or to decrease the flow rate.